God. Judge not. That you will not be judged. For with what judgment you judge, you will be judged. And with the measure you use, it will be measured back to you. And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye, but do not consider the plank in your own eye? Or how can you say to your brother, let me remove the speck from your eye? And look, a plank is in your own eye. Hypocrites. First remove the plank from your own eye. And then you see clearly to remove the speck from your brother's eye. Do not give what is holy to the dogs, nor cast your, your pearls before swine, lest they trample them under their feet and turn and tear you in pieces. Clap for the word of God, not me. All right, Matthew 7, verse 1 to the verse number 6 again. Praise God. Shall glory. Don't judge. That you will not be judged. For with what judgment you judge, you will be judged. And with the measure you use, it will be measured back to you. And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye, but do not consider the plank in your own eye? Or how can you say to your brother or your sister, let me remove the speck from your eye. And look, a plank is in your own eye. Hypocrite! 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 First, remove the plank from your eye. Praise God. And then, you see clearly to remove the speck from your brother's eye. Do not give what is holy to the dogs. Nor cast your pearls before swine. Lest they trample them under their feet and turn and tear you in pieces. Clap for the word of God again. Praise God. Shall glory. Three types of men or three kinds of people. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. We have the natural man. Praise God. We have the carnal man and the spiritual man. Say the natural man. Say it again. Say it again. Say the carnal man. Again. Last but one. Last one. Say the spiritual man. The spiritual man. Praise God. So we have three kinds of people according to uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 3. Praise God. Verse 1 to the verse number 3. Praise God. We have the natural man. We have the carnal man and the spiritual man. Praise God. The natural man is a man without God. The man who is not born again. The one who is walking in darkness, the one without the Holy Spirit, the one who is separated from God. He is called the natural man, the man who is not born again, the man without Christ. Praise God. Hallelujah. He is the natural man, the natural man, the man without Christ. Say, the natural man is a man without Christ. So the natural man is a man without Christ. Praise God. That is a man 
who walks in God darkness, the man without God, the man without the Holy Spirit. Praise God. And we have the Kana man. The Kana man. Say the Kana man. Say it again. The Kana man. The Kana man. The Kana man. man. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. These are spiritual babes. They are born again, but they are babes in Christ Jesus. They are infants in Christ Jesus. They are spiritual infants. Praise God. They walk according to the flesh, not according to the spirit. Praise God. Hallelujah. They walk according to the dictates of their own senses, not according to the Holy Spirit or the Word of God. Praise God. They are believers. They are born again. They come to church. They know how to sing. They can preach well. They know how to play the keyboard. They know how to play drums. Praise God. They can do anything, praise God. But they walk according to the dictates of their flesh. They walk according to the dictates of their senses. They are called carnal Christians. They are spiritual infants, praise God. And it's dangerous to remain a carnal believer. It's dangerous to remain a spiritual babe. Praise God. Hallelujah, because it can lead you to hell. It can lead you to hell fire. Your carnality can lead you to hell fire. Stand up for me as you listen to the word of God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Stand up. You have one minute. Uh, you have uh, one second to stand up. All right. Now let's listen to the word of God. Clap for Jesus. Shout glory. Shout glory. Praise God. Shall glory. Yeah. Hallelujah. Praise God. All right. It's dangerous to remain a spiritual babe. It's dangerous to remain a spiritual infant because it can take you to hell. It can destroy your relationship with God. And at the end, can take you to hell. Praise God. Hallelujah. Don't be a carnal believer. You have to resolve to mature as a Christian. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. All right, so we have the natural man, the carnal man, and the spiritual man. Praise God. This is the matured in Christ Jesus. These are the ones who walk according to the dictates of the spirit. They are not controlled by their flesh. They are not controlled by their senses. Praise God. They walk according to the spirit. Praise God. They are the matured in Christ Jesus. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. God has called each one of us to walk in the spirit, not in the flesh. You are called in Christ Jesus to walk in the spirit, not in the flesh flesh. You must walk in the spirit. Walking in the spirit is, is maturity. Praise God. And walking in the flesh is carnality. What is carnality? Walking in the flesh. See, carnality is walking in the flesh. Say it again. Carnality is walking in the flesh. Praise God. That is carnality. Walking in the flesh. Walking according to your senses. Walking according to what you can see with your physical eye. Walking according to what you can feel. If you cannot feel it, it is not there. It means that you are a carnal believer. Because you cannot feel it, your conclusion is that that thing is not there. Praise God. It means that you are a carnal believer. You walk according to your senses praise god walking according to the spirit 
is maturity. Say, walking according to the spirit is maturity. Say it again. Walking according to the spirit is maturity. Clap for Jesus. Sit down for now. Sit down for now. For now. <laughs> Praise God. Oh, shout glory. Shout glory. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. So carnality is walking in the senses, walking in the flesh instead of walking in the spirits. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Shout glory. Shout glory. Praise God. Praise God. Can our people possess this judgmental spirit? Praise God. Say, can our believers possess this judgmental spirit? Can our believers possess this judgmental spirit? Say it again. Last but one, loud and clear. Can our believers possess this judgmental spirit? Last one. Praise God. Can our believers possess this what? Judgmental spirit. They are always judging people. They are always judging people. They are specialists in judging people. Praise God. Hallelujah. They made themselves as judges in the church. Judging everything. Whatever they see, they will judge it. Whatever they see, can our people will judge it. Praise God. Hallelujah. Can our believers possess it? What? Judgmental spirit. Say it again. Again. All right, say it for seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Last one. Praise God. And according to the Bible, it's wrong. To have that spirit is wrong to have that judgmental spirit in your life. It's wrong to, to make yourself a judge eh? in the house of God and wherever you are. You are always judging people. You are always judging the actions of people. You are always judging. You judge people by their dressing. You judge people by their words. You are always judging people. According to my Bible, which is also your Bible, it's wrong to do that. Praise God. Praise God. Omoa, omoya hunna mu fo no. Eh? Omoya hunna mu fo. Ah, omoya nkoda, omoya nkoda mu din koda sem. Omo din koda sem nya me fie. E bia wonya 1000 years, but wonya koda, nya me ni wonya koda. Praise God. Praise God. If you cry title in the church, they say they be cry title over here. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Ah, me this and we be now so king guy. Praise God. It's them me say, and yem fum so say, ube yo hu te mu fuo. In the church. Praise God. Oh hallelujah. Matthew seven the verse number one. Judge not that you will not be judged. Judge not that you will not be judged. Praise 
praise God. For with what judgment you judge, you will be judged. And with the measure you use, it will be measured back to you. Praise God. It's dangerous to have this critical spirit. Eh? Praise God. To have, to have a judgmental spirit means to have a critical spirit. You are always criticizing people. You criticize whatever you see. Praise God. In other words, you talk against whatever you see. Whatever you see. You want to read meanings into it. You are always talking against things. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is, that is possessing a critical spirit. That is possessing a judgmental spirit. Praise God. And that seat eh, is, is, is meant for only God. Praise God. Praise God. Na ye di pu ateno. Unyami ma uni pebi a kwanse. What na sa kunyani so? Praise God. Sa kunyani e nyam kupon kwa dia. Enu ti rosi me mu ateni na wo mu ateni. Praise God. Praise God. And I say, at the end, who did not see the boy be a ten? And no one is beating us. That is why it is dangerous. And no one is beating us to be a boy a ten. Praise God. Okay. And I say, okay. I don't know what she will be. Eh? At the end, kids will be in foot to be a nia, a nia, eh? A nia, kids will be a quarter of the end. Praise God. Mister Matthew seven, verse one. To the verse number six, praise God. Oh, see, and we are kids will be a cotton wound. We are missing what's in you, praise God. A quack we eat, and we are a finish. I bet I would hear the timber, 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 the tower, this praise God. Would the enemy and yam, we are kids will be you, and you do. Aye, Simba, praise God. In Diakasia, and at that one is it was okay. Now, Kadia Pan is said, and come on, what the only Timba if you win it so. It means that you must work on yourself before you try to work on others. If you are not done with working on yourself, you cannot work on me. What did I make? Praise God. Hallelujah. You must first work. On yourself before you, you try to work on others. Praise God. One see them again. And I mean boom. It's called the one. Ask for water. I will, I will give you one. Praise God. Praise God. If you want to work on me, you must first work on yourself. If you want to change me, you must first change yourself. Praise God. That is the meaning of that verse. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. What did I make? I see. I am from Sosa. And we are kids. We are kids. We are the only one. Praise God. And when you are brave, when you are kids, when you are there, oh, the way. And oh, as 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 you mercy. Oh, so full now. Oh, oh, oh. And you are the only one. And you are the kids. We are the only one. And one how did not who did that when you should buy we see a timber which you know yourself, you know yourself. Praise God. And I see now cut yet your pan is say eh who cry one who ye because who went in a fra who did that when you soon ye praise God it's who won ye praise God. Echikayi yi timba no eh wo de na da woni so kese but mo de na yi na wo timi yi we afi do be hu ne ma ye this be the role of people are judging people wrongly in the church and before you can judge me you must first judge yourself what did i make praise god 
And this is the lifestyle of Ghana believers. They are specialists in judging people. Oh, sha glory. Sha glory. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye? Praise God. Why won't you focus on yourself? Praise God. Instead of focusing on others, you are always looking at the lifestyle of others instead of checking your own lifestyle. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. All right, verse 3. And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye but do not consider the plank, the timber, or the log in your own eye? Praise God. Verse 4. Or how can you say to your brother, let me remove the speck from your eye? Praise God. That is a small thing. Oh. The speck is a small thing. Praise God. Or how can you say to your brother, let me remove the speck from your own eye and look, a plank is in your own eye. Let me remove the speck from your eye and look, a plank is in your own eye. Or see, I then I will call you and check. I then say, hey, mommy, I then I don't want this. My own now, woman is a baby. That one is when you fra praise God. I don't say, okay, I then I will call you and the other man. Praise God. I brought one cast out the end a chain timber. Praise God. Who said this? This is the words of the master. Praise God. I am not saying it. Praise God. And he says, hypocrites. That is hypocrisy. Cannot believers are hypocrites. They are actors in the church. Praise God. Who is a hypocrite? An actor. They know how to act. That is why I said, Usha Fuma, eh? Praise God. You can see Ubiya. We need their friend the Bible. Eh? We need their friend the Bible. But because of the movie, that is the role that is given to him. So you must play the role of a pastor. Act like a pastor. Praise God. And do you see this man wearing Kwakwa Dubi? <laughs> Do you know Kwa <laughs> All right. See me in Jibes and I will, I will explain it to you. The meaning of Kwa Kwa Praise God. Hallelujah. You see this man wearing Kwa Kwa Praise God. Praying like a, a real pastor. Loka Topa. I cast you out. And the Bible says. John 3.16 that this man is acting. Eh? He's an actor. Actor. Eh? That is who a hypocrite is. An actor. Eh? A pretender. Pretending to be righteous by inwardly you are dirty. <laughs> Pretending to be spiritual but you don't know anything about spirituality. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. And to see, when you do that, you are a hypocrite. When you are always finding fault with people. When you are a fault finder, critical people are fault finders. Judgmental people are fault finders. That is why me, I can walk with you for years. You don't hear from me telling you anything. So who said make kasa? Now they my heart now, me. I don't talk. I don't like talking. I don't like pointing the faults of people. That is not me. <laughs> Praise, God. 
Praise God. But judgmental people are fault finders. They are critical people. They are always finding fault with people. Look at the, 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 the dress of that lady. No, that dress is not good at all. Have you checked your own? Maybe I would be a look at the neck and yet. But because you are you are judgmental, you possess the spirit of 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 of, of, um, of you, you you have this this judgmental spirit, you have this this critical spirit, you cannot focus on yourself, you are always focusing on others. People don't focus on themselves. They are not ready to work on themselves. What they do is to always work on others. Praise God. If that is your lifestyle, you are a karma believer. If that is how you are in the church, you are a karma believer. You are not matured at all. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is why these people, they, they become angry by the way that rebukes them. Eh? Cannot believers are angered by the, the word from the altar that rebukes them. If the word is rebuking them, they are angry. What did I make? Omo omo ya ngoda di ngoda sebo nya mi fie. Eh? Na nya mi eni mu se ah so me si o ngo ya ngoda. Ah sa su ba we ma cho se is dangerous because though you are born again but you are living your life like an unbeliever. Praise God. Oh hallelujah. Praise God. Safuno Sasemba every other issue. Na e karenima. Asema e rebuke you amudia. Hey, you see that person frowning his or her face. But when the word says God will bless you, I see God taking you to the top. Uh, a year by this time, you come to the altar with your baby. You see this person saying, say, shouting, Amen, praise God. I receive it, I grab it, I seize it, I possess it. But when the word rebuke him or her, that person will become angry. Ah, Reverend is saying all this because of you. Hey, I will continue to say it. When I come here, I'm standing here because of you. What is that again? Praise God. Eh? The moment I mount the puppet, it's you. It's you. Because, because before I mount the puppet, I pray that Lord, let me let me meet the need of somebody. Let my word eh, 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 travel in the direction of somebody. Somebody must be located. Eh? When I mount the puppet, that is my prayer. That is why I me who be also in Yarasa. I am shining the Osia Yawudia. I always mount the pulpit because of you. Not because of anybody. You, I'm talking to you. No exception. Hallelujah. Praise God. Clap for Jesus. 
Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. I cannot believe us are hypocrites. They are hypocrites. They are hypocrites. Praise God. That is what the Bible says. He says, hypocrite. First, remove the plant from your own eye. And then you see clearly. So they can eat the other one. This one we are. No, but you be me the other one. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. It's, it's dangerous to sit on that seat as a child of God. Because that seat is meant for God alone. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. And yeah, I'm a boomful. I said, me be free all day, so I'm a boomful. Praise God. A bath for your good. Praise God. Hallelujah. Me say, a bath for the A bath man will yield, dear. Anyone cause law. And yeah, me yield. Me yield, dear. Dear, you will yield, dear. And also, I say, I'm the reverend, meow. I say, I'm a baby, I'm a real one now, whoever I did. So I said, I'm the shame you cry. That is good. And only the shame you cry. Now, the coward, you want to say what? Praise God. Shall glory, shall glory, shall glory. Hallelujah. Praise God. Yeah, that is the nature of, of carnal believers. They are angry by the way that rebukes them. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. They possess this critical spirit. They possess a judgmental spirit. They are always judging people. Praise God. But don't be that person. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. These people treat rumors as, as truth. Hmm? They treat rumors as, as, as the truth. Praise God. Spiritual infants treat rumors as, as the truth. They treat lies as the truth. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Because they have this negative lens on life. They are always on, on the side of the negative. They are, they, they are quick to move to the negative side. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. What is the kind? Omoa, omoya nkwadawe nyamifiye. Na omu kra atemu sunsuna. Ah omu omat omu ti akunya sun ti oba ye wat na kunya sun. As the church in the church, church in everything. Praise God. These people they treat rumors as facts. They treat rumors as the truth. Praise God. I do want to watch it. Hey! This is carnality. They treat rumors as, as the truth. They see about the sun and say they are negative people. Eh? Judgmental people are negative people. They don't believe in themselves. That is why they are always trying to judge others. Not hear me. A talk that a year there a one is so much. And now only two of us. Hallelujah! That is that is that is their their lifestyle. Praise God! They always want to pass on, pass on to others what they carry themselves. Eh? At the end of the day, I'm going to go. Eh? 
and no no me to obi so eh ade na wonu be ye no eno na ye ne se obi be ye what did i make up praise god aha enti the onu be ye no obi so obi so be ye this is carnality praise god oh hallelujah what to tell me? Nyanku pon kranu ni madi ni na rudi siya Bible ye. Eh? Abra wati asemfa sodom and gomorrah hono. Osi nyane ko eswo okoshi. One thing you kwenam besem ni ma. Eh? Anya wati ya? Say ah ah! No dear chile. This is carnality. Why won't you go into it and see whether what you heard is the truth or a lie? What did I make up? But because you are too carnal, because you are too judgmental, because you are jealous of people and you want to use your carnality to just criticize them down, you are not ready to look into things. Eh? To know the truth for yourself. And so you are treating rumors as facts. In Sama in Nima Ubika. We have such people in the church. And they are always gossiping about others. Because of this, as soon as he can see, as soon as he no can, what do we say? As soon as he no can, what say no? If you are in a brain, no. If you are in consulting, because because of your influence, you can attract many persecutors. When you become influential in life, get ready for for a lot of persecution. That is why we are criticized on every side. They talk against us every day. Yeah. Yeah, the well, Bible says a city on a hill cannot be hidden, eh? and so when you are not hidden, so and when you are holding a, a, a position, ah, you eh? And just say you are not hidden, and since you are not hidden, you will be a big But when you are hidden, you don't be seen, and so you are free. And then some of you, you must beg me before I let you go. Glory for Jesus. Oh, clap for Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Eh? Uh, Bible say, Abraham. Uh, as I see for your margin, say, hey, you best you be see a band so. Praise God. Yeah, praise God. From the book of Genesis. Now, I can't go Kenya. Praise God. Yeah, yeah, did gene. Yeah, the baby did my own. So, what kind of Bible are? Or see, Nyami can say, Mama Yanko for Hmm? Into Nyanko for Krasi Wokoshi. That's a sign of carnality. You just believe lies about people. Instead of looking into the matter yourself to know the truth in it. In the answer, then you meet Sodom and Gomorrah ten. Or judge you, woman. According to the Bible, he went down. Eh? So on one case, Obi Hu, Obi Hu said, "Ati we ne koso." A chiwati a bomai, mema ne mema da. Ah, a ni nyami a sem enko. Eno no mu ye oko ye koshe. Eh? In this old episode, Danny Timufu, now judgment is a writer. Ah, the crown is a sin. Eh, to, to sit on that chair, make sure, say, before you say anything, eh, 
and you've gone into wait, into wait, into wait, into wait. You have all the evidences. You have all the proofs before you say whatever you want to say. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. But that is the nature of, of, of spiritual infants. They believe every lie about people. They want to accept rumors as, as the truth. And you are talking to that person as if you say, Shut up! Shut up! Praise God! Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because judgmental people always want to um, uh, uh, tell us that they know the motives of people. Hallelujah. They pretend to know the motives of people. Are you caught? Praise God. Hallelujah. Only God knows a person's motives. Know you. Don't presume to know the motives of people. Eh? That is why you are too critical. This person is doing this because of that. This person did this because of this. Eh? When you behave like and that is witchcraft. Hey, what is witchcraft? Trying to think for others. That is witchcraft. What did I make? Who person would Jema would be? Eh? Abra, that thing is not in the person's mind. This wet crap and you by yourself. I'm on, sir. Let me wait till I was here. Only God knows my motives. No, you. You cannot know what is in my mind. Don't presume. To, don't presume to know what is in my mind. You cannot know it. Praise God. Hallelujah. Only God knows a person's mind. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is why he would judge everyone. He would do what? He would judge everyone, including me. He would judge everyone at the judgment seat of Christ. But, but judgmental people, that is your nature. Eh? They always want to presume that they know the motives of people. So cool be team, go the only team. So they are always thinking for people. They are thinking for people. Look at you. If that is your lifestyle, you are too kinda. You are too kinda. This is possessing a judgmental spirit, and according to the Bible, at the end that would need judge you be no idea about judge you. Praise God, Hallelujah! Because they are judgmental, they are quick to detect the fault of others. Where am I coming from? I'm coming from Matthew seven verse one to the verse number six. They are quick to detect. The fault of others, not their own fault, too, but the fault of others. It is not a science, and yet this practicals. One son of Fachemisu Fachemisu, you go on, Castle Fachemisu, no, I see. Oh, Bassa, you are deceiving yourself. So, see, one Satian will be so Fachemisu. Okay. Am I who in your Fachemisu? Okay. Fachemisu. Okay. One Sadis and Hemisu. Okay, four on the way, Hifa. Four on the way. 
Ewahe. Okay, Safa Hebe Subiu. Lady. Na Ave. On Sana Sene Hebe Subiu. Sing. Sing. Five. Now, who fingers na Ese? Ese. Five. Okay. Ana what sense Ewahe Subiu? What sense Ewahe Subiu? One, no. Fall away. A question wants to pursue you. Ah, let's see. For no one that's trying to show. Sayib you, Safan Sun Him Subiu. Okay. A camera for Mucho Bian and Sarah in the Kama Kama Panamere. Now you have a beer for Nivea. Uncha and Sabia, the Kama Kama Panamere. Okay, that is perfect. Okay, I'm a woman. Satya, hey, what is that? So, I'm a woman. I'm a woman. I'm a woman. Hey, uh huh. Okay, I'm a woman. 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 Praise God. That is why the verse number three of, 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 of um, Matthew 7 says, And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye? But do not consider the plank in your own eye. Just say, what do you need for? Against one. What do you need for? What do you need for? And those people are on the seat of judgment. They should be on the judgment. But they are not ready to work on themselves. But they want to work on others. So I didn't see that you can't get out of it. You can't get out of it. And you can't get out of it. And you can't get out of it. And that's why you can't get out of it. Because you can't get out of it. When you get out of it. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Spiritual infants, spiritual babes, carnal believers are quick to detect the faults of others, not their own. They are quick to know the faults of others. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. And the power of the Holy Spirit. Ne enyo ono ankasa di ono ankasa di oni mfumso. Beni di anye four, ni di anye ni anye one. Sati onse ni biushe mso for the last time. Okay. Ah, bakro anye ni so anye ni pa. Ukukuru kutini ni na biushe one kasa so. Ah, we anye bakro anye ni me pe me pe first one on this one. Aha, this one is good. Praise God. Hallelujah. We anye ya. Uh, from Ukokro Moti, Ninjina, eh? Ninjina, Besha Oso. Four Ninjina, Besha Oso. One pen, and a family missile. Praise God. Just say, you fall on the field, so I'm sorry, you want a family missile. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Shall glory. Shall glory. Praise God. Hallelujah. Yeah. That's the nature of spiritual babes. They are quick to detect the mistakes of others while they are blind to their own errors. Errors. Praise God. Because our no one casa diemo, then ye frau. And temper who huni nyanem fumso. That is carnality. That is having a critical spirit. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. That is having what a critical spirit. Oh, usul sumo, eh ya akasa akasa sumo, 
eh, eh, sul subai di bre ni passe who you christo new who was so concro so we are now ya be for juma we want judgmental people are always tearing down lives they always want to tear down people they want to pull down people they are not interested in the progress and the successes of people Praise God. It's why all your kids when you know how to pray, you know how to do everything in the house of God, but now you are working as a witch or a wizard. Because of that attitude of yours. Praise God. Am I preaching? Praise God. Shall glory. Oh, shall glory. 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 Hallelujah. They, they ignore everything good about a person and fix on only the negatives of others. Praise God. So one can say, yes, I want you to make it. Who say what? Why am I making it? Who say what's it? Who do you say why? Why am I making it? Why? Why? And you are making it. Who say what? Who's asking me there? Why? Who say why? Who say everyone's asking me there? Why? Is that not you? This word is for you. It's for you. Praise God. Hallelujah. They ignore every, everything good about others and fix their eyes on, on the negatives of that person. That is their nature. They ignore. It's something that they decided to ignore. I refuse to look at the positives of this person. I, I will just focus on his or her negatives. That is the nature of those with a critical spirit those with a judgmental spirit in the church they don't want to focus on the good side of people always looking for the negatives always looking for faults praise god oh hallelujah yeah. and if that is your lifestyle it means that you are sinning and this thing can take you to hell that is what's it check not or you'll be judged. Praise God. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. But according to my Bible, the Bible says that you must overlook the pitfalls of others. You must overlook the flaws of others. According to the Bible, it says that love covers a multitude of sins. And love is God. Love is the nature of God. Love is what? The nature of God. It says that it covers a multitude of sins. It overlooks the pitfalls of others. A mutra. Afu from fungsua. A mutra. Afu from sinto. Eh? Odo eshe. Afu from amode. Na. A shepherd day. Now the more I wash a baby, I'm holding what day. Now a home away, baby, I'm renoco for Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Judge not that you will not be judged. For what judgment you judge, it will be, you will be judged. And with what measure you use, it will be measured back to you. There will be, there will be, you will now be judged, you will be, nah. And no one in your mind, no, they are judged you. It was me, what a, near what a. Oh, 
Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Don't just conclude matters and eh? conclude issues concerning the lives of others. You hear something, you just draw your conclusion. This is it. You draw your conclusion. That is the work of judges. Eh? Honor what the final say. Praise God. Eh? If that is your lifestyle, just say, why you are to move for? When was the last time? Please just look, look inside of me. If there is any error, correct it for me. The pain na wanka sa uyebi as was that a man for dear na debi a ujina su. Hallelujah. Don't pronounce final judgment on, on, on a person for you are not a church. You are not a church. You are not a church. Praise God. Don't look at my dressing and church me. Don't look at the way I talk and church me. Hey, your uncle, for what said, if you are mobile, we are mobile, who say we are spiritual. Now, listen, never mind any attitude because you are always crying. This is carnality. And to be our best of Baha, and Yami was an amigo, I just want to teach you something. Praise God. Who was on the Reverend Abasha Tadi Fufu, no, the Arico could be a book, Neha, Nanny Nego from Na. Eh, or by no proof. And someone said, Reverend, you're spiritual. I'll be trying to pay you. So, I said, Who said, Reverend, she will be a new moon. Reverend, who man, I will moon. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Sing, sing, sing. Why are we here? I'll be trying to pay you. Because that is not my lifestyle. I decided to love people genuinely. Praise God. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Why no basa? Why no basa? Why no basa? Why no basa? Why no he said, baby, to me, my wine home for fair, fair, come, come, pa. Praise God. On was on baby into no, no, eh, over pons, or so on pep pons, me, what? That is you. It be on the pons. It's you, Siana. Hey, and that's a special pop pons, he party, and what did you be? Shut up. Are you a judge? Shut up. You are sinning, hey. This thing is dangerous. You may not like it, but that is the favorite of that person. Now, no call, baby. You see, you two and your chair, Bonnie. I had the anchors out two and your chair, Bonnie. In general, the show team, Nadia Mafia. In Jusia, who me, baby, are making a heart, or your MC. Ah, Satan, the person is at the team and yet. Ah, these people, pa, look at, look at her, look at her. What is in the niche? Oh, ah, Baba, we pardon, oh, yes, sir. Now, come in, the power, me, Tinny Cassa, not a Cassa, every day, pa, ah, what is in the niche? Look at you. Now, no, what is here, see, if there is a mesh, mesh, or whatever. Praise God. Who got to say, I see, will be bought Mesa Mesawa. Praise God. It's a sin. Who got to a baby, not the baby. In Juba, I was a smashy about mesh. Ah, ah. What did you know? 
Look at you. Don't pronounce your final judgment on a person. Eh? Men be a no more be a thing. Because that seed is meant for only God. Clap for Jesus. Oh, clap for Jesus. Praise God. Hallelujah. Stop addressing the negatives of others. Stop it. Stop always talking about the negatives of others and start focusing on their positives. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Judgmental people always focus on the flaws of others. They focus on their flaws. They complain a lot. They are always complaining about something. They cannot be quiet. Because babies are talkative. They, they love to make noise. They are always making noise. You refuse if you are correct, you just know. That's a crow of you. It's also got that of you. But when the place is quiet, you can just know that we don't have children in the house. Because children are talkatives. They are noise makers. They make noise all the time. They are always complaining about issues. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, praise God. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to somebody here. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Those who are always judging people cannot live without complaining about something. They always want to complain about something. The reason why they want to complain about something is that they, are, they have this spirit. Uh, they have the gift of suspicion. Uh -huh. The gift of suspicion. But we don't have that gift in the Bible. We don't have any gift called suspicion in the Bible. One, two, three, four. Don't, don't have that gift too, I beg you. The gift of suspicion is dangerous. Eh? When you have that gift, you are always sus. I suspect that that you draw your conclusion. You are a judge. Yeah? If that is your lifestyle, it means that you have the gift of suspicion, and we don't have such a gift in the Bible. We don't have the gift of suspicion in the Bible. Suspicion will take your joy from you. Hey, my man, can we have me here? We are coming 80 minutes. No, baby. Because I'm on God's major walk up. We want to say, Jesus. To me, a dear Bakwa, a draining nipper strength. Hey, a suspicion. Ah, and no, no. Dear Woody, a friend of suspicion, you know. Hey, dear friend, no. Judgmental spirit. And they would have a suspicion. You are always suspecting something. Eh? Praise God. It, 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 will, it will drain away your strength. It will, it will take your strength from you. Eh? Because it will make you joyless. Eh? So there be all this uh, 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 suspicion eh? in, your, in your mind. You are always suspecting evil. Suspect. Saying something evil. Adia Bakwa ebe ya one se. Ebi wia wanije. Do you become joyless? And when you become joyless, you become strengthless. Ah. Yeah. When you become joyless, you become strengthless. For the joy of the Lord is your strength. Praise God. And he said, Sadu Ultima. And when it's now, as soon as you appear, I was suspecting. Opie, no. Edie, no. Yeah. 
This thing is collapsing a lot of relationships, collapsing a lot of marriages. Because, say, the mimi frame, the gift of suspicion. But we don't have such a gift in the Bible. Don't, don't receive it. It's a gift from Satan. Don't take it. So, I say, we have this clear conscience whereby all the time your mind is clear, whereby all the time your, your conscience is eh, eh, clean. Praise God. Say, Ukrasa, Ajin, we are. Dear friend of suspicion, Emel. Now, Ebasa, why you move down? Eh, you are free. You are free. You are free. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. I come in five minutes. Shall glory. Shall glory. 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 Shall glory. Praise God. How can you say to your brother, let me remove the speck from your eye? And look, a plank is in your own eye. Hypocrite, first remove the plank from your eye. And then you will see clearly to remove the speck from your brother's eye. Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Shout glory. Hallelujah. When they see somebody succeeding, when they see somebody doing well, they want to find something wrong uh, with it. Praise God. They want to find something wrong to say against such a person. That is a rule of judges in the church. Praise God. Hallelujah. They are always reading meanings into things. Praise God. I don't know. Say, Lord, I give you glory that uh, my brother is riding his own car. I didn't have so urum ah I did with the akwe. That Praise God. We have such people in the church. When they see prosperity, they want to find fault with it. But don't forget, sir, my God just said, I didn't know what I said. Who Say you don't want it. Praise God. Yeah. The more you talk against something, the more you scare away that thing from your life. Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Um, the way this person is looking is telling me that mm, he's doing this or that. Ah, this person is always looking good. This is telling me something. Are you a church? Why would you praise God for the life of that person? I tell people you look good. Praise God. You look good. Your, your dress is nice. Your, your face looks good. Praise God. I'm happy to see you looking good. I'm not envious of anybody. That is why I'm blessed. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. What did I make kind? It is so who no prosperity, who no koswa, sre nyame, eh? Sra nyame, na se impo, ebi ane ya kwa mboni impo swa, unye nyame. What did I make kind? Oh, unye nyame. Let God do His work of judging that person. You are not in, in in a position to judge anybody.
Praise God. I come in one minute. Now, Nyamia and my next week, we will continue. Clap for Jesus. Sha glory, glory. Sha glory. <laughs> Praise God. God bless you. God bless you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. May God bless you and give you your own car in Jesus' name. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is why the most dangerous person to me is the one who don't respect the anointing. To me, to me. Yeah. Praise God. Praise God. To me, onu ni pa ni muye mi mu oni wiasi mi mi wiasi ame o ni pa won respect the anointing. Praise God, Hallelujah. One to the mekan, and I don't treat such issues lightly. When I catch you talking against anointing, I love you. That one is there, <laughs> but I'm ethical. I know how to deal with such issues. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You think what is happening here is by luck. That time, the kind of discipline you must go through. The kind of discipline mentally, you don't sleep. You do everything to make sure you give out the best. Somebody somewhere will just talk anyhow. You can say it, but when you are closer and I catch you, now I'm, I'll push you where you belong. <laughs> Praise God. That time you have to sweat and sweat and sweat and sweat and sweat for a miracle to take place. You think it's easy. You think it's easy? Then ask God if it's easy. Then ask God if it's easy. You think it's luck? Then ask God if it's my luck. That's why some certain people I want them to go and do what I'm doing here and see if it is my luck. Go and use your luck to get what is happening here in your place. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. You have to learn to control your tongue. Eh? Learn to control your tongue. Spiritual infants don't know how to tame their tongue. Eh? Umunim city is and taming your tongue is a sign of, of, of maturity. So the city I'm not, this me I am not. Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. So you me I am not a chill with me. I'm paying for Casa Casa Baza. So when I'm Sunamica. And you see, uh, either be somewhere, not a casa, so see, penny, g, manti, manti. So if I'm right, penny, penny, g, ne manti, manti. She said, as I said, penny, where penny, where you matured, eh? Now, or per se, <laughs> somebody is asking for the meaning of what I just said. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Shall glory. <laughs> oh, shall glory. Praise God. Because a penny, you know, or per se, and yes, same man will be to my kent, you know. What was it? Now, so if you name a brew, and she, what the crowds want to just who knew any man, man. The reason why you cannot keep quiet. 
is you are always listening. Hey, hey, this person is. Where do you go on some ten? Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. Shall glory. Shall glory. Shall glory. Hallelujah. When was the last time you spoke about God outside a church function? When was the last time you spoke about God to somebody outside church? Praise God. Junior home. Junior home. Praise God. When was the last time you invited somebody to come to church? When was the last time you interceded for somebody on your knees? The Lord, as we are going to church today, bring souls from the north, south, east, and the west. In the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody must be born again. In the name of Jesus, let your wind bring them from the north, from the south, from the east, and from the west. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, there's somebody who is living in darkness right now. It is my prayer that your light will shine upon that person for his or her deliverance. In the mighty name of Jesus. This is spirituality. And so who? We tighten the ukra. Any idea we win in our action. So we can kasa konkon sound kwa. Come on, sir. Maybe. You don't even know how to. Hey, according to the Bible, eh? Maybe, maybe. That's what you have to reverence, maybe. It's a glory. <laughs> Praise God. And according to the Bible, say, why well, you must be teachers? And when we are supposed to be teachers, eh? So I bring on a yes, the foundation uh, things of the Bible. Praise God. And just say, spiritual infants, they, they, they cannot talk about Christ. It's difficult for them to talk about Christ to others. Where is your soul? Where is your soul? Okra, okra, when you are not away. So, what could I come on power with my abo, Nipa, Kubitians, as soon as it did, and as soon as it bit to me, I can say, Miss Sumina, maybe because of as soon as home. Jesus, pray and clap your hands. Yes, 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 yes.